Our struggle has reached a decisive moment. We call on our people to seize this moment so that the process towards democracy is rapid and uninterrupted. We have waited too long for our freedom. We can no longer wait. Now is the time to intensify the struggle on all fronts. To relax our efforts now would be a mistake which generations to come and will not be able to forgive. The sight of freedom looming on the horizon should encourage us to redouble our efforts. It is only through disciplined mass action that our victory can be assured. We call in our white compatriots to join us in the shaping of a new South Africa. The freedom movement is a political home for you too. We call on the international community to continue the campaign to isolate the apartheid regime. To lift sanctions now would be to run the risk of aborting the full eradication of apartheid. Our march towards freedom is irreversible. We must not allow fear to stand in our way. Universal suffrage on a common versus wrong in a united, democratic and non-racial South Africa is the only way to peace and racial harmony. In conclusion, I used to go to my own words during my trial in 1964. They are as true today as they were then. I have fought against white domination and I have fought against black domination.